71 degrees in early March in Kansas? That's a miracle. Hey guys, how's it going? So I really, really need to do something. I need to clean the air filter on my car, which I'm betting a lot of people need to do, but tend to overlook it kind of like I do. Just one of those things where it's like, yeah, I'll get to it at some point. You know what I mean? Um, another reason I wanted to make this video is because I have a couple new things that I'm using. This is a new lens. It's Canon's RF Nifty 50. Very fun. First lens I've bought for this camera that didn't, not including the, the kit lens that came with it. I also am now using a tripod. Yeah, I've used tripods in the past because, you know, who the fuck hasn't. But I uh, never owned one. So now I own one. It's a fluid head, so that everything is nice and smooth. Goes side to side like that. That's the wrong one. It goes up and down too. It's great. That's what we're gonna be working with now. Um, yeah, let's go do our car. You ever find a bolt you didn't know about? You know, you know, I don't know what size this is, so we're just gonna guess it's this one and call it good. And if it's not, well, I'll cut it. Holy shit, guys. It is the right one, but it doesn't work. Can't get the thing in there. Sucks. We have this guy now. Look at him, he's so thin. He's got a little angle to him. He's cute. Yeah, so it looks like this guy's not one to come out. Um, we're probably just gonna have to take the filter off, then take the tube out, then take the filter out, which is a pain in the ass, but you do what you gotta do, right? If you're ever having any problems getting to something, feel free to literally climb into your engine bay. Everyone's done it. Well, every mechanic's done it. Okay, so turns out I can't get my filter out by just pulling it out because there's not much space, which means I'm going to have to take my jack, jack my car up, take my wheel off, take the liner out, and then pull it out. <sighs> Look who just got home, Tulsa. I had no idea. Hey! Yeah, that was a pain in the ass. Uh, but here it is. It's kind of, it's kind of awful looking. Here, let's take this rain guard off of it. Yeah, rain guard for filter. Gross. Let's clean that shit up. Um, 
I don't think there's a, a standard practice on how to do this. So I'm just gonna rinse it off with some water. Call it a good day. As you can see, this is not a how-to video, as I am making many, many mistakes, probably. You know, I think this was blue when I first got it. Yeah, oh yeah, look at that foam. Oh yeah, that's what we wanna see. Sure, that's probably good. You know, when I started this, I didn't consider the fact that my filter was probably going to have to dry before I could drive it again. Oh well, you live and you learn, right? We got our filter all clean. Um, it looks absolutely no different, um, which may be a good thing, maybe I just didn't clean it right. Uh, yeah, let's, uh, how should we get this to not be wet, because I have to leave in 30 minutes. Let's blow dry it. All right, we're gonna call that good. It feels pretty dry, it's mostly dry. If there's any water left in there, it'll just get vaporized when it's, uh, you know, exploded. All right, so now we just have to put it back on. So this little thing, what it does is it keeps all the water out from this thing so that water doesn't, when it's raining, uh, water doesn't go rushing into here and gunk it up and, well, kill your engine. Great thing, it's got holes in it, need a new one. Oh well, let's dust that back there. Great idea. Let's take this. Which way did this go on? Like that. Yeah, that's what it is. This is probably the right one. We're almost there. We're I almost got it back in. We got it. Now we're just going to reattach this one right here. You know, this would be easier with a drill. You know, an excellent skill as a mechanic to have is to be able to look at a bolt and know exactly what size that bolt is. This is a 10 millimeter, for instance. And what I mean by that is it's actually an 8 millimeter. A lot easier. See? Oh. I dropped the wrench. Cool. All right. Our filter is securely on. Our intake is securely clamped to everything else. We should be good to go. Let's give it a startup. Hope it doesn't sound like dog shit. seem good let's go back inside all right so that's gonna be all for today um, yeah not a very big job not a very hard job not even something that maybe I even really needed to do now that I did it and seeing how much dirt was on it I thought there'd be a lot more but there just wasn't so which is nice I guess um, but oh well with that being said I'm gonna talk to myself later one quick surprise real quick Look at this cute little girl! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Mm. With, that, with that, I'm gonna let you go. See you later, guys.